Thanks for joining us on your Kentucky at a home. I'm with Mike with the LPK Group and Primary Residential Mortgage. Thanks for joining us again. Absolutely. Thanks for having us. You know, I'm really excited to have this conversation with you because there's a common misconception out there that it's really hard to get financed and it's not. Yeah, it is. It's uh, people think uh, with the 2008 crash uh, <laughs> that happened, it's put everybody in a situation of, of uneasiness. And um, so it is, you know, in some respect, the thought of being challenging from a lending perspective can, uh, you know, consume someone's thoughts and, and make them not think it's obtainable. But uh, in today's market, it, it is. And uh, it's really just about of figuring it out uh, from a perspective of the loan and how we do things. and. Um, you know, that's why we take a doctor-like uh, approach. We take a lawyer-like approach and sit down and counsel with the individual and ensure the financing to the highest level that, that can be uh, possible. Um, so yeah, it, it, it is, you know, perceived from the general public that it is hard to obtain financing. Uh, the reality is, is that, you know, in today's world, it is in our best interest to, to help you uh, find your dream uh, and get you into the home uh, that you're looking for. And the market is very, the market is telling us that it's not hard to get financed because it's kind of the wild, wild west out there right now. I would agree with that. It is a, uh, it is a wild storm going on right now. Uh, the, the homes are, are moving very quickly. Uh, the, the two, you know, the 200, the 175 range uh, is a very, very fast moving, uh, you know, I guess you'd say product, mm -hmm. uh, but the, the homes itself are, are, are moving and, and that's a good thing for the economy. Uh, it, it's a very positive thing for, for everyone, uh, but it is something that you have to act fast. I mean, if you're not moving uh, and you're not getting yourself in a credit approved state, uh, it could be challenging for you to obtain the, the home of your dreams. So let's talk about what acting fast means. You know, the, the first rule of thumb when you're thinking about buying a home or selling your home to buy a new one is you go to see your favorite loan officer. Sure. Th and that would be the, the ideal situation. Yeah. Uh, a lot of people like to window shop. Uh, and what I mean by that is they like to think they can obtain that home uh, prior to knowing that they can afford that home. And, mm -hmm. and we really try to, to counsel with our real estate agents and, and to our buyers uh, and educate them that, look, you really need to sit down and, and, and know that you can qualify and not make the assumption or, or the thought that you, know, you can because you make uh, a decent income, because you have in the past, uh, today's lending, you know, rules have changed, uh, not for the worse, but for the better. And uh, it really is important for people to sit down, sit still long enough, take the hour to an hour and a half, uh, you know, meeting, uh, and know, hey, you do qualify for this this product and this loan and this type. Uh, and there's many products that are out there, you know, FHA, VA, conventional, uh, USDA. I mean, goodness, the the the. the portfolio of loan programs is is overwhelming for, for most people uh, and that's why we say hey it's important for you to sit with somebody that's a professional uh, mm -hmm. that sits still long enough to tell you hey this is the right loan program because every loan program is catered towards the individual so so you, your neighbor may got an FHA loan your neighbor may have a conventional loan your may your neighbor may have a VA loan uh, so it's truly based around the individual and it's not something that is for everybody uh, every loan is different and it's unique to the uh, individual itself so when you say it's unique to the individual itself are you talking about credit score debt to income ratio those type of parameters Yes, ma'am. Uh, that's that's a yes. Very well said. It's completely about the the person's credit score. It's completely about the the person's job history. It's those are, are factors that we're going to look at at a very deep level uh, to ensure the success of the repayment of the loan. That that's what we're after, uh, and that's what we do here at the LPK Group. We we really counsel at a, at a deeper level. Uh, we look them in the eye and make sure that uh, this is the, the the best program for them, uh, financially, uh, long term. Uh, there, there's a whole lot of factors that, that play into this because some people say, hey, I'm buying this house and I'm going to leave in five years. That's going to require a different loan program than, than somebody that says, I'm going to be, this is my lifelong, uh, you know, dream home that I'm going to stay in uh, or an investment property. So, so there's many factors that, that have to be played in and uh, it's not a one size fits all kind of scenario. That's interesting. I never thought about how long you're going to stay in a home mm -hmm. being a factor of what type of loan that you are going to get. Yeah, it, it is. It's, you know, it's, it is important. It's the biggest decision in most people's life. I mean, uh, the next thing that people equate to a home is, is your car. 
Uh, but those are thirty, forty, fifty thousand dollars in some cases. This is hundreds of thousands of dollars that, that people are investing in, and so it's really a big decision. And uh, the terminology that was in the industry for for many years. I've been in this thing for for going on this is my fourteenth year. So, so knowing. Uh, that, that it is a big deal. The, the, the terminology of no big deal uh, was used for, for many years uh, and today it's not the case. It is a big deal uh, and we don't treat it lightly. And let's talk about credit scores for a second because you don't have to have a perfect credit score to purchase a house. <clears throat> That's correct. It's, uh, you know, we've, we've qualified people, and let's just say this, FHA has no restrictions to credit score. They, they truly don't. Uh, they look at uh, the individual. I've seen loans that, that have a bunch of money to put down on a home um, uh, and good job history. And if it makes sense, we're interested in looking at the financing. Uh, the reality is, is that is sometimes a credit score challenge that, that may come up. Um, but it's not the, the, the stop or, or the hard stop that prevents people from saying yes uh, or no. Uh, it really it is a unique situation to each individual candidate because things happen. You know, bad things happen to good people. All right, well, thank you so much for joining us today, Mike. We really appreciate it. Absolutely, thank you. If you're interested in getting into a dream home or upsizing into a newer home, be sure to give the LPK Group a call with the information on your screen. Hi, I'm Kimberly Greenwell, host of your Kentuckiana Home. Every Sunday on WBNA 21, we take you to beautiful homes where you meet the builders that build them, the realtors that sell them, and the designers that make them absolutely amazing. Tune in every Sunday to see absolutely gorgeous homes at 1230 WBNA 21. Your Kentuckiana Home. Brought to you by Window World.